I'm Mark Cady, and our road tripping adventures bring us just outside the town of Franklin today to the centerpiece of the Cowie Valley. Today we're at the historic Cowie School along with Bob Cuppers, and there's a great history to this school and some great things that you're doing with the building now. Tell us more. Mark, Cowie School was one of the last schools built under the New Deal. It was completed in 1943 until up until about five years ago, it was a full up elementary school. Since then, it's been turned into a cultural and arts center, uh, which we have an enormous amount of activities. We have a couple of full up artist studios. We have a, a uh, pottery studio, a, a studio that does mountain weaving, and also other historical uh, displays that you see now. Not only that, we got some pretty good music out here. I hear there's a guy to talk to about that. There is, Barry Clinton. So Barry, I hear there is a lot of music that happens right here at the Historic Cowie School. Tell us more. Absolutely, Mark. Uh, we're in our third full season of our concert series, which runs from May through October, and we get international touring bands, recording artists that come in here. We're real excited about the program. Uh, another show that's coming up, or another event that's coming up on August 20th, is the Folk Festival that'll be held on the grounds here at the Historic Cowie School, which previously had been held downtown. Now we've partnered with the Folk Heritage Association, with the Cowie Board, and now it's going to be held here. So we're real excited about that, and it'll also include music. And this room, this is a gymnasium, and, and it really goes and undergoes a complete transformation when you bring music in. Absolutely. We fill this place up with chairs and people, band set up on the stage, and it's a wonderful venue. It also has some other uses, but this is its primary use right now is for the concert series. Well, there's one more place in Cowie we need to check out. Let's go check out Rickman's. No trip to the Cowie Valley is complete without stopping by the historic Rickman store, and Jerry and Elena are with us today. And what makes this place so special? It is, you can just feel the history as you walk in here. Well, it was built in 1895. We are open from May until December from 10 to 4 on Saturdays only. And it is in its present state an old country store. All of the artifacts that you see in the store were donated by local volunteers and it is run completely by volunteers. It's a place where people can come and relax, have a cup of coffee, listen to the musicians, see the various crafts, and local crafters and just have a good time. Make sure your Saturday stops include the Rickman store. In fact, a big jam kicks off every day, every Saturday at noon right here. Learn more about our adventures road tripping just outside of Franklin in the Cowie Valley with the road tripping link online at WLOS.com right out of the community tab. Road tripping in the Cowie Valley right outside of Franklin. I'm Mark Katie.